So I basically ended up buying a mouse that I can actually do PC gaming with. So I actually have a much more proper setup instead of using a shitty mouse pad. So what perfect game to test this out than the greatest shooter of all time that is Gaze of War. This game is fucking stupid. That's another thing that fucking sucks about this game. You listen to revive your allies. If you go down just once, you're fucking dead. It's fucking stupid. Through the door. Take cover. Take cover. So I hate this fucking game. But whatever. Get ready. Here they come. It is massively fucking overrated, by the way. I fucking hate this fucking game. I don't know how much I would have summoned this game, to be honest. I just find it immensely fucking boring. There's so many fucking games that came out since then, it's just kind of hard to distinguish between this and the others, honestly. I don't know. I just never liked this game series. Dude, I thought I'd turn off tooltips. I guess not. I guess it's just for, um... I guess just because the first act or whatever the fuck. But still. Okay, man, here we go. You still got it? I guess we'll find out, huh? Got a really shitty PC port. The fucking multiplayer you can't even play with bots, so it's basically the exact same shit as fucking Halo back in 2001. And so much the fucking stepping stone for every fucking cover-based shooter ever made. Before and since. I really do not like this fucking game series. And also a really shitty collectible system that does nothing besides boost gamer score. So that's fucking nice. Forgot about that too. Oh, there's these cogs that define the whoop service they serve of boosting your gamer score. Wow, that's really fucking uh, original. Oh, but the multiplayer is so fucking good. Oh, but can you play it by yourself? No. Oh. Well, fuck. So I didn't even uh, address the fact that the PC version got extra campaign doubles that like, could very well have been sold on console at the time, but they didn't fucking do it. So that's fucking scummy as hell. <laughs> Basically getting the equivalent of um, DLC that was never released on the superior version, I guess. It's just fucking stupid bullshit. And of course they have a two weapon limit because fucking Halo did it, so of course every other fuck needs to do it after, right? It's just fucking stupid, dude. I hate it. But this is the thing I don't understand. It's like if you die, you have to oh, you always have to restart from the last checkpoint, but whenever your allies go down. You have to revive them or else you just we lose a little. It's just, it's just fucking bad design. No I hate it. Resonator. Roger that I don't even care that I die. It's just like, why doesn't the game abide by the rules of engagement? It clearly fucking doesn't. It's just fucking stupid. I'd rather have this so that if if they go down or whatever, they just get back up on their own or whatever, or just not have this stupid shit at all.
Yeah, I, I can't play this anymore. I can't. This is just too fucking stupid. I hate this fucking game. But at least that proved to be um decent success, I guess. I'll probably play it whenever I'm not in a shitty mood. But yeah, I just think the game is fucking boring as sin. I hate the combat system. I hate everything about it. It's just pure, unadulterated trash. Would actually rather play Doom Eternal than play that shit. I'm not even fucking kidding when I say that. Because there's a lot of fucking titles I'd rather play than Doom Eternal, and well... <laughs> at least uh, Doom Eternal doesn't, um... I don't even know.